Here we go, karate against Kun Kumir. This should be a very interesting battle. Both men leading with their left hand, so orthodox stance. Leaping in with that right hand, Rothana. Landed shot. Oh, wow. Missed the jumping, spinning back kick, and ended up on the ground here. He's got the half guard. As Rothana is working to pass. I do believe it kicked it, that spinning kick, though. But uh, his momentum took him down. Could step over that half guard, but he's back into full guard now. It's Rothana with his back to the mat in the black shorts and the ponytail there. The plaited ponytail. On top, it's Chan. Sorry, it's Gonzalez, and on top is Chan Rothana. Up the sweep. Gonzalez is back on top in the half guard of Rothana. Let's see what the ground game looks like. Stuck inside the half guard. Very close quarters here. Not much room for any punches to be exchanged. Let's go, guys. Work. Cheek to cheek, aren't they? Not much dancing going on, though. Ruthana back into full guard. Elevates. He's got. He's trying to go for an old plata, maybe it looks like. Or. Oh, passes the guard. Gonzalez on top in side control. Gonzalez looking to drop some elbows from this position. Let's go, guys. Just 10 feet away from us, cage side here in Stadium Putra. Got a good crowd here, although it's still early in the evening, but already they're packed in. Knee on the, on the forehead. Trying to use his feet. Oh, back to the feet. Gets the single leg. Rafana pushing Gonzalez up against the cage. Furious commentary coming from the corner man as well. Gonzalez is defending well. Grab the fence. Don't grab the fence. Rothana's got him in a front headlock here. Now what can he do with it? With his back against the cage. Don't grab the shot. Don't grab the shot. Don't grab the shot. Olivier Cost telling the fighters not to grab the shorts of the opponent. Also not allowed to grab the cage there, which, right, which Gonzalez does right, do that. Ready? Ready? Fight! Of course, if you grab the cage, you can you can work your way, get a bit more leverage than you need. There's that spinning back kick again. A bit lower that time. Hasn't worked out too well for him on either occasion. He ate a big shot there. He's trying to sweep, trying to elevate the legs. There you go. Gets up, going for a heel hook, it looks like. More of an Achilles lock. He, doesn't... he has the foot there, and he's trying to go for a straight foot lock. Took a few blows to the face in the process, but he's definitely got the advantage. Rathana's trying to roll out of it. Punches to the chest. And to up there to the face. Oh, it takes a heel to the head. That would hurt. He's not letting go of that foot. He's trying to finish from there. Oh, oh, he out. slipped out. He, he took a few hammer blows to the head there and a number to the chest. But in the end, it was to no avail. Trying to get hold of that leg again. He seems versed in the footlocks, but he's got to try to extend back. He's eaten a lot of punches by doing that. Oh, up on top, full mount, raining the shots down. Ground and pound coming from left and right, not just straight down. That's how to beat the guard. Come from the side. Walk to finish, walk to finish. Vary the angle of the punches here. Elbows to the neck and to the ear. The punches come down again, and Olivier Cost has seen enough.
Look out for that back leg of Chandler Town. And that's one way to make it. Get him on his back. This crowd is loud. Good movement on top from Fernandez. But even though Rotana gives up a takedown, he has been able to get back up to his feet. Fernandez needs to do a better job of holding him down. See, look how he's scrambling out. Now he sinks in the hooks on the back. Now he's trying to flatten him out. Now this is where Fernandez is dangerous. Look for him to drop some heavy bombs. Rotana trying to survive here. Fernandez in control in the early get-go of this second round as the back of the Cambodians. He's a bit high on the back. Rotana could be able to shake him off and sneak out the back door. Fernandez needs to get a little bit lower. He's trying to stand up, but Fernandez does a good job with those hooks. See how he's controlling the legs there with the inside of his feet? Now he's bringing that right arm right across the chin. That's more of a face crack. Might be able to get in the Oh, back. is this it? Is this the end for Chan Rotana? Now he's going to be OK. He's got that hand. Look, see how he's defending with the left hand? Fernandez was able to get it back up. Let's see who ends up on top in the scramble, though. As the back again, there's Ebro Fernandez going to slide down. Yes, he does. Now Rotana, top position. Here comes the ground and pad from the Cambodian. This place going bananas. Good defense so far from Fernandez. He's not taking a lot of damage. He's utilizing the feet on the hips to create a little bit of space. And a lot of these shots aren't getting through. But just give Chan Rotana a matter of time. If he keeps picking these shots, eventually he's going to land a big one. Body shot there from Rotana. Then goes back up to Fernandez's jaw. Back to the belly button. Fernandez tries to be up here. Let's go. This shot missed the time of Rotana. It is deafening in the Axiato Arena. This is on the second match of our brilliant. Oh, God, okay. And there's no oh. relation in the ring. Oh, big right hand smack bang for Rotana. Don't hit it. Abro in trouble. Rotana, a house on fire. Halfway through the second round. The ferocity of the Cambodian. These exchanges are making a, taking a tremendous toll on their energy expenditure. Chan Rotana said he spent a lot of time no. working on his gas tank, making sure that when he gets involved in these aggressive, exciting matches, he wants to have the gas tank to deliver all his techniques. Fernandez is cut. His hands are low. He's breathing through his mouth. He is tired. Can Rotana finish it here? Fernandez may be right. For the picking, he runs away from Rotana. Rotana on the front foot. Kim Ching saying to engage. Rotana comes forward, goes for a rib kick, tries to pull the head down. The snap, the pepper isn't there for Abro Fernandez now. Big left hand from Rotana. Fernandez drifts back to Sutter Cage. He can't lift his hands up. Rotana takes his time. In control, the Cambodian. High right roundhouse kick for Headache Maker. Left hook to a right hand. Good combination from the Cambodian. A smart move by Fernandez, but he can't stick the takedown. Rotana able to pop back up, and you can definitely see Rotana looks like a fresher athlete. That gas tank is definitely there for Rotana as we're approaching the last minute of this very action packed round. Look at Fernandez just taking big shots from Rotana. Rotana's patient on the big knee. Oh, the ground and pound. The good night, Irene. Look at that. Nice little straight right hand to a left hook combination. See Chan Rotana starting to get a little bit light on his feet. Now he's starting to move around a little bit. Not so flat-footed, not so planted. Rotana knows that Rudy Agustin is fading a little bit, so he's using his footwork here. Not allowing Agustin to time it for the takedown. Chan Rotana misses on a big leg kick as he lets out a little wail. Rudy Agustin lets him know he appreciates that shot right there. As soon as Rudy Agustin closes that distance, gets into that striking range, Chan Rotana throws a big right hand. Chan Rotana is not afraid to throw combinations in three rounds. He has the conditioning to do that. Like 
that body kick. Like how he's starting to work in this way. Rudia Garcia might be starting to fade. There's no takedown attempts coming. Nice hand combination thrown by Chan Rotana. This is what Rudy Agustin wants. Rudy Agustin wants Chan Rotana to commit on the striking exchange and look to another change off it. Chan Rotana looks to be the fresher of the two as we're approaching the three minute mark of the second round of this mixed martial arts contest. I like the leg kicks, I like Chan Rotana throwing those leg kicks. It's gonna slow down that shot attempt coming from Rudy Agustin. Tonight he's throwing that uppercut from way back from Phnom Penh. Chan Rotana doing a great job of doing long range strikes, not over committing, not allowing Rudy Agassiz's sure. face to clinch up. Nice little fake there. Beautiful left kick, straight right hand combination. This is not the same Rudy Agustin that we saw in the first. He expended a lot of takedown as he runs right into a knee. You have to think, Mitch, is Rudy Augustin trying to conserve energy for the third round, trying to push hard? Not a good strategy against Chan Rotana, who's known to be able to go three rounds. And Chan Rotana's pacing him apart right now as he catches the kick, throws him to the ground. Here comes the ground and pound by Chan Rotana. Oh, Rudy Augustin's got a move. Chan Rotana's gonna go right past this guard, right into the side control of mount. Big right hand landed. Augustin not doing much in terms of defense. Well, that's it. He needs to lock up Chan Rotana here. He can't just defend. He's got to intelligence to defend himself. Otherwise, Kim Chang is being forced to jump in and stop this. Try to slow down the attacks of Chan Rotana. Try to get it under her. Good job. At least Chan Rotana was still able to lock in a guillotine. Chooses to teach, switch around, take the back. Keeps punching. Oh, beautiful ah. stoppage. Chan Rotana found his moment. 